please subscribe and don't forget to press the bell icon to get notified whenever we upload a new video. But let's talk about the other big deal. There's a big buzz of a deal between Walmart and Flipkart. As we know, the $12 billion deal, it gets closer and louder. Sources tell CNBC TV18 that the legendary founder of SoftBank, Masayoshi Son, has met with Walmart's global CEO to finalize that deal. Remember that SoftBank, with its 20% stake in Flipkart, was holding out for a better offer. And a lot of the early investors of Flipkart, like Tiger Global, etc., could make a big killing with this one. Kritika Saxena joins in now on the phone line to give us more details. Kritika, as we inch closer to the deal, what more are you picking up? Hi, Sonia. You know, this is, of course, a critical deal. Uh, we are expecting this to be closed within the next uh, one or two weeks. Next week is what has been anticipated in the markets. But, you know, SoftBank was holding out, as you said, for a better price. Uh, what has made them change their mind is Son and Doug McMillan, that is the president and CEO of Walmart, uh, meeting earlier this week. We understand that they have ironed out uh, uh, some critical areas in terms of price negotiations. And over and above that, they have reached a mid-ground as to what they want from uh, Flipkart and India plans for the joint entity of Walmart and Flipkart going forward. So what I understand is that there was a critical meeting uh, uh, wherein they have uh, charted out an integration plan as well for the two firms. Uh, SoftBank wants to stay invested, so they aren't going to be pulling out. They have 20% stake. But yes, they, it is time that they start consolidating their investments in India, and that is what they are looking at doing, along with looking at growing specific investments. So 10% is what they're likely to sell. It could be slightly lower based on the conversations that happen in the next few two days, but 10% is what is being discussed at this point in time, which means essentially they retain that other 10%. Now, we already know that uh, Walmart is looking at a majority. All right, so that was uh, Kritika Saxena on the phone line.